Hey guys, today we are going to talk about our current favourite things. We've got a few beauty and skincare products, but we've also got a few more random things. My first favourite is this. This is a perfume oil. I'll show you, hold on. The packaging is so amazing. It's a perfume oil. It looks like this. It's by Ortigia Cecilia. Wait, can I smell it? Can I smell it? Yeah, it smells so good. It's by Ortigia Cecilia. It's called Fico Dindia. And I have the notes in my phone. They are cactus, Ooh. orange blossom, fig leaf, fig, and cedar. It's quite a green scent and it's kind of woody but it's also quite like soft and sweet and I just I'm like obsessed with it I even have it in like a roller ball that I keep in my bag as well um, and I have candles of it and I have a room spray of it and basically it's the best scent ever first favorite I have is this and you might be thinking that looks like a toothbrush but also kind of like a makeup brush what is it for let me tell you there have been a lot of videos of people talking about um, those Artis brushes. They are so expensive, £300 for the whole set. But everyone raves about them. So I did a little bit of research because I wasn't going to drop that kind of money on something if I didn't know whether I would like it or not. So I found this on Amazon, which was 36 pence plus a pound postage. So it's £1.36. It's like a little makeup brush for foundation right well I think you could probably use it for a lot of things you could probably use it for contour mm. you could use it for foundation it's quite small but it does actually do it quite quickly Depends on the face size. and when I first got this I hated it but then I tried it again the other day and it looked really nice so I don't know if it's a bit of trial and error what foundation you use and kind of how you use this how much product you use but it's worth a go for £1.36 this is the Oz Naturals 2.5% Taxanthin and Vitamin E Professional Correcting Serum. Amy got me into this brand, Oz Naturals. They're also sold on Amazon and very reasonable. I just love Amazon. I am super, super, super into retinol, retinoids, retin-A. Anything that's like a vitamin A derivative, I will be about that specific life. So I got this. I used to have really bad acne. Using retinols kind of like turned my skin around. I absolutely love this, like it's made my skin texture so much better. Do you think my skin looks better than it did like two months ago? It does look very smooth. Yeah, really. it looks smoother I think. This like helps your skin to regenerate itself. It fills out fine lines if you have them over time, not immediately. Corrects scarring, things of that nature. It's just amazing, like I absolutely love it and it's really not that expensive for good skincare either. Speaking of skincare, another one of my favourites is these are sheet masks. What are they made of? Fabric or paper, but they're soaked in a kind of wet serum. So you put it on your face, like a mask. So um, like a mummy. You look very scary for the half an hour that you wear it. And then you take it off and your face is still kind of wet and you can rub that leftover serum in and go to sleep. Add moisturizer if you want to. To wake up with very, Smooth skin. We were like crying last night because we put them on and then put our glasses on over the top. <laughs> so these ones are the brand Tony Moly. Korean brand, I think. They have all different types. Uh, I've just got a few here to show you, but I have a whole other pile because they were £11 for 11 Also on Amazon. This is not an Amazon sponsored video, sadly. This right here is a big current favourite of mine. This is the MAC Reflex Pearl Glitter. You guys probably have heard about this before because the MAC reflex glitters are like quite well known. It is so stunning. I have it on my lids now. I don't know if you can see, like if I move my head around. Um, I can see. Yeah. It looks white in the thing, but you put it on and it looks like little shimmering pieces of glass, basically. It's very iridescent. Yeah, it's iridescent, but it doesn't have like a pinky sheen or like a bluey sheen. Multifaceted. It's like diamonds, basically. It's like diamonds. It's beautiful. This is by the brand Revolution or Makeup Revolution and they're sold in Superdrug. And this is the, sorry it's a bit dirty, I've been using it, the Highlight Palette. It's really great, I think this was £8, comes with three shades 
and there's a whitish gold colour, a peachy pinky colour, and this lilac-y oh, silver colour. No, because the mirror is going to flash uh, They're all beautiful. They yeah. give a really nice highlight. I really love the golden one in particular because I'm very fair and it looks really pretty on me. They're great and cheap. My next favourite is by Sleek. Sorry, the outside's looking a little bit dusty. Um, it's the Sleek Oh So Special palette. It's really, really pretty. I have been using hold on, these two shades. Wait, is that right? Yeah, those, those two shades. Um, they don't have names, I don't think. To do like a rose gold eye and then put um, that MAC Reflect Pearl glitter over the top. And it looks so cool, like I love it. I absolutely love it. It's got some really nice browns in it. It's got a really good black in it and it's got a bone colored shadow that you could use like all over the lid and before you put any other colors on to set like a primer or whatever. Or you could use it as a highlight if you were a little bit deeper. I just love it, I think it's amazing. They're so pigmented and so inexpensive and they're just a shit. Sleek eyeshadow palettes in general are great. My one is this NYX Tame and Frame Tinted Brow Pomade. It's basically a copy of the Anastasia Beverly Hills dip brow that everyone raves about. This is a fraction of the price. It was mm. maybe six pounds. I'm pretty sure it was around five, six pounds. And it's essentially a bit like a gel eyeliner, but for your eyebrows. Yeah. That's the best way I can think of to describe it. So you use a small angled brush. The one I've got is a MAC 208, but any small angled brush would be fine. Dip it in, draw, paint your eyebrows on with small strokes, and then it sets and doesn't move. It's great, the color's great. This is in brunette. I'm loving NYX in general at the moment. You can buy it on Boots online. And you can buy some things on ASOS now as well. Yep, and I think they're rolling out into boot stores slowly but surely. Everything from NYX is great. I love their concealer, I love their liquid lipsticks, soft matte lip creams. You're having loads of faves. The fave is the brow gel, but anything from NYX is a winner. <laughs> My next fave is a food fave. Okay, these are so addictive. Let me just warn you before I show you. These are the Food Doctor Hot Wasabi Soy and Corn Crisp Thins. And if you like me, love wasabi burn. You know that feeling you get when you eat like too much, no, the burn. Your eyes are watering. It kind of hurts, like it does hurt. I would say these don't quite get you to that level, but they almost get you there. If you eat like three at once, I guess they probably <laughs> would. Haven't tried it yet, but I probably will now that I just thought of that. They definitely give you like more than just like a tingling feeling. They're pretty spiked or pretty hot, I guess. Not really a spicy and hot same thing. Kind of. But anyway, you get the picture. They're so delicious and so addictive and only 98 calories per pack. My next one is going to be this little guy. This is the Fujifilm Instax Mini 8. This is like an old Polaroid camera before they were discontinued. It's really cute. I will show you how it works. Maybe we can take a little pic now. They give you small kind of credit card size pictures. I'll take a picture to demonstrate. <laughs> now we wait. So the picture from my Instax has developed and it's cute. I cut Chloe's face out a little bit by accident. What a surprise! No, not really. <laughs> you can see that. Look how cute they are. And you can get all different film with like Rilakkuma on it. Different borders. A dotty one. Like, it's really cute. I, I just love it. My final one is this watch that I've been wearing like pretty much every day recently. It's by Olivia Burton. I got it on ASOS. I have another watch which is a Nixon really huge watch. It's large and in charge, but it's kind of too big for everyday wear. So I got this old and black and I love it. I've been wearing it all the time. It fits my wrist perfectly as well. I didn't have to get any links removed, which is amazing. My final favorite is, <laughs> this is special, a book by an esteemed author, How To Be A Bad Bitch by Amber Rose. On the surface, you think, oh, that's a bit of a silly title. I might not take her really seriously. But this book is full of wisdom. It's, Gems. it's essentially a self-help book. Dropping truth bombs. Yeah, she's writing from her life experience about, she came obviously from not a very good background, 
um, and worked her way up and is now a superstar. Full of advice about finances, friendships, relationships, self-esteem, so many things. So I really recommend this. Thank you, Amber Rose. Can I borrow that? Yeah. Cool. We'll put links to everything we've talked about in the down bar, down box, down bar, down bar. Those were our current faves. We hope you enjoyed this and if you want to see more fave videos in the future then leave us a comment down below. So, bye guys. This is a bit like an old school Polaroid camera. Said that really weirdly. <laughs> Said that really weirdly. Polaroid. <laughs> this is like an old school... Oh. We're filming. Wait five minutes.